Hey everybody, I'm back with another Jada Toys movie and TV inspired kind of vehicle, diecast vehicle. It is Duke, so there's Duke, a little diecast figure, and the Vamp, the G.I. Joe vehicle. As you can see, it says it's for ages 8 and up. Now it's interesting because on the back, they also show Destro and Hiss. And as far as I've been able to find, they have never released this yet. However, they do have the Vamp with Cobra Commander, and I have seen that around. This is part of the Hollywood Ride rides series uh this retails for 11.99 12 dollars along with the other one i was lucky i was on amazon one day and they had a sale for these for around six dollars which was a steal i thought but last i checked it was actually up to 12 it was over 12 dollars the uh, cobra commander one was more at the 12 dollar price point but those prices fluctuate let's go ahead and take this out of the package and take a closer look all right, we got it out of the package. Here is your little diecast Duke figure. It doesn't look like he has a smile. There's just a little line, but you know, for a little diecast figure, it's not too bad. I like it. it. Might make a good collectible to put in the background. So yeah, that's Duke, and he unfortunately he's not really going to fit into the the vamp too well, is he? I mean, there he, look at there he is driving it. So well, we kind of get him in there. Look at that. All right. Check that out. He is totally driving that. Yes, nothing awkward about this at all. And here is the vamp itself. This is pretty nice looking, honestly. I like this. You got some details on there. Um, thankfully, you do not have to put on your own stickers. You can check this out. This is a, a die-cast vehicle. The turret moves. You can move it. It's held down by a little like, clear rubber band in the box that you have to remove. The This itself, here's the bottom... It is a one thirty-second scale die-cast vehicle. There's a little screw, a Phillips head screw that you have to unscrew in order to get this out of the box, which actually is not too not too uh, bad of an idea because you can actually put it back in the box and screw it back in if you want to display it in the box after taking it out. It has a copyright year of 2021 on it. I didn't notice it until this year, but it may have been out last year. I don't know. Sometimes the copyright years don't coincide with the dates and it rolls pretty nicely too. I mean, if you like GI Joe, you know, this is not a bad deal, especially for the $6 price point I got it for. So I would say, you know, check it out on Amazon, watch it, see if the price goes down or if you think it's worth 12 bucks, pick it up. I think I've also seen these at um, Target, I want to say as well. Little fake uh, plastic gas canisters that don't come out, but it's the Vamp by Jada Toys Hollywood Rides Collection. I hope that they do more of these. I do. I think the Hiss looks great. I want to get the Hiss if that comes out. Wouldn't mind seeing a Snowcat. I think the Snowcat would be cool as well. Let me know, you know, what G.I. Joe vehicles you think would make for a good Jada Toy Hollywood Rides mini diecast thing. So Duke and the Vamp. I like it. Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. And I will see you next time on the next Nosework Gamer video. Yo, Joe.